Hey guys, so let me explain what happened yesterday. I actually had a really good day. I walked to East B Hill Road, elevation 1485, 1,932.9 miles, which is pretty epic. But I thought the road was gonna be a lot busier than it was. I got there about eight o'clock. I was thinking, right, I'm gonna hitch. Hitch a ride into town or I'm gonna phone a hostel, come and get collected and go do some resupply, etc., etc., etc. First of all, the road was like a gravel road. There was like no cars, one car passed me. And I did try and thumb a lift, but didn't, he didn't stop or she didn't stop. And then I thought, right, let's get my phone out. No service. So I was literally like, what do I do? So I thought, ugh. So I carried on walking for about maybe like another half mile. Found a flat place to set my tent up, which is what I've done. So. The next road that I'm going to come to is about 10 miles away, 1,943 miles, and I'm going to have to go in for resupply there. I mean, I've got some uh, mashed potato, some tuna, and some nutrition bars, so I'm fine. Like, it's it's okay. It's not ideal, but it is what it is. This is one of the, the most difficult things, is when you're trying to do, like, resupply. Like, really, I should have done it when I got into uh, the last place I stayed. I can't remember what it was called now. Um, I should have done that, but you know, I got in there at like half nine, quarter past nine, and there was no shuttles into town, so I couldn't resupply. And then in the morning, you know, the first shuttle wouldn't have gone to like 10, so therefore, you know, by the time I come back, it's like 12, that's half a day. Um, on resupply, it's just too long to do. So, anyway, the time now is Oopsie. okay, so it's six, six nineteen. Thursday 31st of August which means we've got 11 days to get to Katahdin and we've got a grand total of 257 miles to go booyah let's do this up and get walking as quickly as possible and this is where I camped last night at a river this is breakfast, booyah. 10 past seven, Thursday, 31st of August, 11 days to go. I'm starting walking. I'm trying to be bold and start cold, but I've still got my pink thing on and my jacket, but I've taken every other layer off. So I'm gonna get moving. So, oh, and we're back on the Appalachian Trail. I'm gonna cross the stream, follow that white blaze. Um, let's get to the next road, 10 miles away. Let's get a resupply, let's get back on the trail. Let's get moving and let's bash out these miles. It's gonna be September tomorrow, that's scary. Okay, chat to you later. Hey, I've been climbing Moody Mountain, all 0.9 miles of it. Just gotta face this, it's like sheer vertical. Once I get over Moody Mountain, 1.8 miles to the road, hopefully I can get that by 12 o'clock, I can hitch in three miles to get grocery, resupply food. Oh, I need some food. Okay, come on. Check out all the pink leaves. Love it. Right guys, time is 12.15. I have reached the road. It's not looking very busy, but there's lots of very cool A's on the road. Oh, this is a nightmare. This is this has to be the most, most frustrating thing. Because obviously I, I hate wasting this time. And this is what it's all about. You know, I've got to you know hitch a lift into town, get resupply, get hitched back out here and carry on. But I thought it was gonna be a bigger road than this, I really did. I just hope someone comes because I can't go into the woods with a packet of mashed potato. Okay. Jackets, clothing on, keep warm and keep fingers crossed. I've got this, I don't know if you can see on my shoulder because I've got this like mole and it's like basically like rubbing on my backpack. I've also put the stickers um, or these mole skin things on the back of my hip bones because my pack now is on the tightest everything and it's loose on me and I just can't get it any tighter. So um, yeah, right, I'll keep you updated. Hey guys, just come to an awesome store, just done a resupply. So I've got myself lots of goodies. It's packed in here. I've got a few little uh, muffins and goodness and cakes and stuff. I'm now gonna go across the street and go get some food. And then I've got a lovely couple who are then gonna come and collect me and take me back to the trail. Yay! 
just sat down, got my electronics charging, going to do a little bit of Wi-Fi, order myself a, I can't remember what I've ordered myself, like food, going to eat and then this amazing couple is going to come and collect me in about 50 odd minutes. So yeah, just going to get myself all sorted, recharge, energised and get in the zone. Myron? So guys, I told you that I met this awesome couple who have driven me to Uber things. Say hi. Just a minute. Hello, say what, hi. Hi. What are your names? Myron Bridges. Myron Bridges. And Diane Bridges. Total legends. They collected me, driven me out to this little town, told me where I can get my resupply. They pointed me out to the little red hen where I went and got an amazing lunch. I'm now absolutely stuffed and now they're gonna drive me back to the trail. Legends, both of them. Woo! It is 2.43. I am back where I started on the road. I'm gonna start heading up these steps. So a couple of big mountains to climb. I feel so full. Somebody just asked me, how are you feeling? And I was like, I feel so stuffed that I want to be sick. Well, I've eaten a shed, excuse me, load of calories. So I'm literally ready to burn. Got my new food, got some Gatorade, got some electrolytes, got some new food to munch on. So yeah, let's just get on and see how far I can walk. I think I'm gonna be doing some night hiking tonight. So just need to get the miles in, get them done. I do feel re-energized, but oh my God, my stomach is feeling full really full okay and this is why i don't do exercise on a full stomach because this is not pleasant and this is what i'm facing more ladders and stairs oh my goodness this is brutal oh Elevation. Oh, a little bit windy, a little bit breezy. Oh, I'm still so full. My stomach is like, oh, but I'm carrying on walking because we've got lots of miles to do. I think it's a lot of downhill now, which is really good. Oh, oh. okay, let's follow the blazers, let's continue into the woods. 